for our last four bras to try. So these are wireless bras up to a size J cup. Let's get into it. They come in their own laundry bag. Their own laundry bag, which is perfect because I'm running out. <laughs> First bra on. So this one is the Hannah 2.0 Enhanced with W Support Adjustment Bra up to a J cup. This is also available in six different colors. This is the color Dark Taupe, I believe. Oh, sorry, Mocha even better <laughs> so their sizes you don't go from like a 44d and so on and so on you go like 1x and that has its own range of sizes 2x another range of sizes so you really have to go by that so this bra really focuses on being supportive and comfortable i can tell you it does just that so i am being separated which is something i really wanted not like too much but just enough comfortable all their brows are super comfortable like you've got the wide band in the back you've got the wide strap in every single bra you can take the straps off and crisscross them in the back that is an option <laughs> but this is cute i'm getting a little bit of a lift not too much but they are a little up there so i am wearing a 5x i believe and i am usually a 44d so like i said you have those brackets of different sizes this fits me fantastic i have it on the very loosest clips on the back and there are four clips clasps in the back to really keep it secure next thing padding is very 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 thin but it's not going to you know show anything through the padding is removable but it's also sewn in right around the whole cup so you're not going to have it moving around either So this next bra is the Kelly 2.0 360 Jelly Gel Comfy Bra with Boob Separation up to a J cup. This one comes in a whole different cute little bag, comes like a soft little satchel. It's nice. This one is in the color Pistachio, but again, six different colors, mostly neutrals, but then they do have a red option. So similar to the one I am wearing, kind of has the W shape at the bottom, has the removable pads, and you'll see what I mean for this, that they are kind of stitched right around, so they're not gonna twist and turn in there. Also for the cup, I'm not sure if it'll show, yeah, it's showing. Up here at the top is smooth, but down here has got this ribbing, and I'm assuming that is kind of like where the gel is because it is a little bit thicker there. So yeah, it's different. <laughs> In case I forgot to mention, each bra does come with its own little extender, just in case I really do like that option because sometimes you might just need a little extra room back there. So that is perfect that they already supply you with that. Here is the Kelly 2.0 on. So again, you have the very wide band in the back. It also goes really high up in the sides. So it's kind of tucking in that little extra pieces of fat you may have right there. You have the thick straps adjustable straps they crisscross in the back this one is supposed to target not having uniboob more separation and it does give a little bit more separation than the previous one also i have no gapping which is usually a big issue for me i would definitely say other bras are definitely geared towards separation comfort and not having the wire the comfort they hit nail right on the head because the bands are really breathable, really thin, but really soft at the same time. The third bra, we have the Harbor 2.0. This one is kind of similar to the first. It has the W band at the bottom, which you'll be able to see better in when I have it on, I mean, because it kind of comes up. And this one also has a bit of a scalloped edge at the top and a neat feature it has, it has these jelly bands. You can see that there goes all the way around and under and all the way to the strap there. That is so, like if you're wearing a t-shirt, it can kind of adhere and hold in place while you're doing stuff. This one is probably my favorite one of them all. I feel like it gives me a little bit more of a lift. You can kind of see there, because I don't have like a full cup up here. Most of my boot is like down here. So this kind of makes it more evenly dispersed. So if I stand up properly, you can see the lift a little bit there. Again, I don't have huge boobs up top. It doesn't come quite as high as the last one, but it is still thick, comfortable waist or back band, sorry. And it has like 
the W shape with the gripping underneath all the way up. This one is the only one without removable pads, which I am okay with. I know a lot of people like the option. But on to the last one. And this one is white and slightly different in texture. So the last one we have is the Haley Subtle Striped Seamless Bra with W support band up to a size 44, which is what I am. I am a 44. A 44D. <laughs> So as you can see, it is white and it does have the very subtle ribbing design across the chest and on the band underneath. Oh, the band on the back as well. You're not supposed to be able to see it through on a shirt and I believe it because it is very, very subtle. But this is so soft. This is probably my least favorite of the four bras, I think. Um, I don't think it's just doing it for my shape. I feel like it's not hugging in this area right here, so I kind of have that extra little side boob love handle. Is that what we're calling it? <laughs> Under boob? Armpit boob? You know what I mean. It, it's there, okay? We can see it. And it's also not giving me lift, and I am someone who does like lift, but if you don't, this is fine. I mean, it's still lifting them, but it's not pushing them. <laughs> I like, oof. <laughs> Still, for comfort, 10 out of 10 for all of them, including this one. This one, the pads are removable. Just a tiny slit at the top, you can just pull it out. But it is still kind of semi-attached, where it's like sewn in, but not actually sewn in. It's just so it doesn't move around and twist and turn. But this one fits good. The ribbed material is probably softer than the rest of them, actually. It's really comfortable, really stretchy. It just doesn't suck this in like the others. And I keep forgetting how much I'd like white. You can kind of see it better here. Like it doesn't smooth that out. It doesn't look bad whatsoever. It just doesn't give me like a push up, but that's fine. It still is giving support, but that is everything for today. I just want to say a big shout out to For Less for sponsoring this video. Overall, I am pleasantly surprised with each bra, the packaging 10 out of 10, the comfort 10 out of 10. For the most part, I would give the actual like cupping a 9 out of 10 just because I don't have a full bust. It's more rounded down here and this one just doesn't do it. But for not having wires, it's, it's pretty good and comfortable, which I am not used to. I really appreciate the boob separation because most of my bras don't do that and it is hot out and I need some ventilation. <laughs> All links will be down below for you. I don't think I have a discount code, but if I do, by the time this goes up, I will put that in the description box as well. But that's everything. Bye guys.